<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'll give you a group, Mr. Daniel Pick. My pleasure. And the only thing that I remember, I was 
out with my football team, and I generally remember I say down the sim. Jamie would say stand in the seal and shake him. <laughs> I was supposed to be dancing with Amy, and I seemed to think that her, her skirt was a little too short, and I kept telling her that it was too short and inappropriate for a late night club. <laughs> I guess I was practically married there. Um, so I can't say more on that, it's not very romantic. So I tried the first date. I had only been back for two months from the 11 months travelling or whatever it be, and I thought, oh brilliant, I've seen everything, I can watch, try some new things. So we didn't go to Mexican, British or French, and so came to uh, Japanese, and insisted on sushi. Oh, you've been there, done that, you know, it's easy, apparently. And we insisted on fish eggs, and all that I remember of that, after, is that Amy spent two days in bed being sick, <laughs> <laughs> this is her last day at work in her old job, and I think she may have missed a leaving party of probably kids. <laughs> so I'm looking too well there. Finally, I thought the proposal that must be romantic. It <laughs> was a very nice restaurant about half a mile from our hotel. Okay. No, I was a fool. They didn't have anything now. I think you could have already. And I planned to walk along the beach and do a very cliche thing on one knee in the sand under the moonlight. Yeah, that's what I planned. <laughs> heavens opened <laughs> beyond belief and if you walked for more than 10 seconds you could you wouldn't walk anymore you were swimming so it wasn't possible so in the end we jumped in the taxi went back to the hotel and ran across the road and bought a 20, 20 pence can of singer beer <laughs> went back to the hotel and up to our balcony and whilst thunder and lightning was outside I dined with Canada Lago for some motivation. Thank 
Krishnan, and then I'll just come say one more thing about Amy, and then we can finish. Um, so if everyone, before we do the toast, sorry, I'd like to listen to bridesmaids, <laughs> and their health has been outstanding, and you've done so much, I know how much you've done on, on hairdos, not the <laughs> Yeah.